What time is it? It's science time! That idea about repelling is what's actually going to move our car across the table. And so I have the stack of magnets here and we're just going to look at it. They're all stuck together. But if I take this one and I flip it over, it jumps all over the place, right? Likes repel, opposites attract. So I'm going to take these circle magnets that have this hole in the center and I'm going to place one here, place one there, and I'm alternating them so that their magnetic fields are pushing against one another. Look at that. And then I can actually cause them to bounce. And I can shoot them all around. That's because likes repel and opposites attract. So if I want to pick them up really quickly, I can put them all back together and have my stack. So we're going to take this and we're going to apply it to our race car. London, what else can you tell us about our topic today? After doing more research on magnets, I learned that Earth is actually a giant magnet. The Earth's core generates a magnetic field, which creates magnetic poles. Scientific tools like compasses are attracted to the magnetic poles of the Earth and help with navigation. Compasses have been around for nearly 2,000 years. Thanks, London. Learning about all this magnetism sure does build an appetite. This cereal? It says that it has lots of iron in it. I think we should test it out to see what happens. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. The cereal's attracted to my super strong magnet. There's iron in there. <laughs> Thanks for being part of our crew today and checking out this short clip from DIY Science Time. If you like this clip and you want to see more exciting science, check out the full versions right here on the channel. Be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for more exciting DIY Science Time.